Hello you beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. So today is another instalment of my declutter, start out with my makeup room. So, so far I've already decluttered my primer drawer, my bronzer, my blushes, my highlighters, my lipstick drawer didn't really need decluttering so I did that not too long ago. Um, but this drawer is a whole nother level, so yeah. <laughs> this is crazy, so I'm going to be going through, this is basically lip glosses, kind of like long tube lipsticks and then like liquid lipsticks are all in here and I do have new storage to go in these drawers because I did have these all organised which were the most stressful thing ever to put together would not recommend it's really good for like I don't know if you can see these drawers really really good um but for like longer things like this that you always like need to rearrange and stuff an absolute nightmare so I've got some different things from Ikea which is what Amy from a Patreon recommended so I'm I will do a video like setting all of that up with them. Yeah, for this one, I'm just gonna declutter and go through everything. Let's go through the ones at the front, which have all fallen. So we have some W7 Better to Pout ones, which I've not actually used. This was like a Christmas gift set. Um, we've got four of them. I think they were like gingerbread and stuff ones. Doesn't say any names on them. But there's gonna be a lot of sniffing and looking at formulas of this because some of these are going to be really old. This one smells like Christmas, but like not very nice Christmas. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. Oh, yeah, that one's like cinnamon. The other one, I don't know what the other one smells like. I'm sure these all had different scents, like gingerbread and stuff. I don't know what that one is. Maybe one was like peppermint, but I'm really like, I don't know, I'm a bit funny about scents and stuff. I don't know what that one smells like. I'm going to see if my friend Laura wants these because I haven't actually used them. And I no doubt I'll have these colours <laughs> somewhere else in here. So um, I'll see if Laura wants them. And then down here we have some Matrix ones. Um, which again, I might see if Laura wants for like Halloween-y stuff. Because I definitely already have some of these anyway. So yeah, I'll put them into a better home these ones and some of them i will ah oh, have a finger i'm gonna keep them for now because they're a present so does that mean i'm so bad at decluttering stuff i'm gonna get rid of this revolution one because like i said no doubt i'll have duplicates of stuff in here but i don't actually think i have any other black liquid lipstick so I definitely might keep them that NYX one just because it was a present um so let's start from the back so I got all of these in a um like a pack oh and like a bundle of somebody on Depop all brand new so I'm definitely going to be keeping these because these will come in handy for like cool looks and you can also use these on the eyes as well which is really cool and moving on to the next row oh my god these are my hooded ones 100% keeping these because these are bougie as and i want to actually start using them more i have this one from l'oreal i don't even think i even got around to trying this you know mm, it smells really nice let's see what the color looks like well oh, the formula's weird oh i like that a lot that's so nice and you can see because my head's like blocking <laughs> from it. I'm gonna keep that because that's the thing. I want to go through these, get rid of ones that I'm not gonna use, so that I can actually start using the ones that I do have. I do have all of these ABH ones, which oh my god, these are so unbelievably drying, like so drying. It's insane. Like we were talking about this. I was talking about this to somebody at work the other day because I was just like, remember like when this was all the thing. But these were so, if I remember rightly, they were so drying. But I feel like I need to start testing all of these out again. Like the colours are absolutely stunning. Let me have a little sniff test. Mm, that one didn't smell. I'm going to get rid of the nude one, definitely, because it smells funky. This one smells okay. I'm going to keep that one. Because some of had, I've had longer. That one smells funky than others, so I'm going to get rid of that one as well. That one's nice. Keep that one, and then we have this other red one, I'm sure. Yeah, that one's funky. As well, so I'm going to get rid of these three, and I can't give these to a new home, unfortunately, because they stink. <laughs> 
So yeah, definitely getting rid of them. We have some more bougie ones. This is what I mean, like I want to sort these out so I can actually start using them again. So we have this Too Faced one, oh, which smells funky as well. The colour's so nice. That's that top one here, do you can see. There we go. That one. Oh. Yeah, but it definitely needs, I need to put it in the bin. Like I need to get over myself. I'll have got this cheap from somewhere anyway, but I don't know, I just don't like what bin and stuff. We have a Cardi one, which is a recent purchase. Oh yeah, smells just like Cardi's ones normally do. And then I've just kind of put it just underneath, underneath here. Gorgina. I have a feeling, right, that matte liquid lipsticks are coming back. I have a feeling. L'Oreal about to launch some. I just have a feeling it's coming back. So this is K... Oh, again, stunning. This is um, like KVD Beauty, which is a recent purchase. Again. Um, and then we have the Rev ones. going to keep them because they're obviously new launches. We have the... Oh, this is the Plastic Boy um lip gloss i'm gonna keep that then we have all of these ones back here so we have some like kind of like long bulleting like lippy stick things these color pop ones i had quite for quite a while so let's sniff some of these that one doesn't smell the best <laughs> so i'm gonna try to sniff them so unfortunately all of the color pop white ones smell really bad these ones are quite um recent ones a girl at work, Ruby, um, she sent me some stuff like ages ago, which was so sweet of her, like PR that she had like doubles of. So these are recent, um, so I'm really excited to be able to keep these. They smell really nice still. Oh my god, that colour is absolutely stunning. But yeah, I do, I did actually really like the formulas of them white colour pop ones, but unfortunately, they just thingy. The um, there's them too shades they just didn't smell very nice and i've had them i'm not surprised they don't smell very nice because i've had them since when was uh when did i get them uh when i was in uni so yeah um and it was like when i did my degree not even my master's and you've got to think since then i've done my master's i've done a postgraduate i was at work for a couple of years in between <laughs> as well so it's been a long time coming so yeah finally got rid of them got over myself then we have some little bougie Nars ones, which to be fair, I feel like these need to be in a different place. Like I feel like these bullety ones and like these colourpop ones need to be away from like the liquid, um, like the liquid lipstick ones because I'm not going to reach them unless I'm thinking that I'm going to go for a matte liquid lip and like they're stunning, especially when I'm going to work and I'm going to London, like they're going to be perfecto. Um, so yeah, be keeping them ones they're ones at the back by the doll beauty ones that i got recently so i'm not going to get rid of them obviously then we have these p louise ones which i need to start using more often we have this mac one let me smell this one because it still smells the same this is like <laughs> so so bright but i'm gonna keep that because that's still okay to use this one is kind of recent as well so that one will be safe to use still and then in the middle oh, these are the revolution like the contour um lip kits like their matte liquid lipsticks from, from the kit so they're all okay still and then down here are my little fenty glosses which i feel like again i need to have these like on a better display because i used to use these all the time i've just tried to wipe all that off by the way um i used to use these all the time when they were in like my little um plastic like acrylic storage and not stuck in this drawer so i feel like i need to do something better with this because i'm just not reaching for anything anymore it's really frustrating i'm definitely going to be keeping my charlotte tilbury liquid lips i've used this one quite often for like nights out and stuff i'm going to go red and then in here we have matte um liquid lipsticks from red so i'm going to get rid of these game of Thrones ones because i don't know if you can still get these anymore so i'll see if any of my friends want these instead Honestly, like to be my friend now, it's part of the job description where you have to take makeup off me because <laughs> I just have too much and I just don't want it to go. Obviously, I know I still have a lot where it's probably going to still go to waste, but I just don't want 
it to go into the bin like I want it to go to a new home if it can if it's still in date and it hasn't been like used and it's unhydrated to use and stuff and my friends are not bothered at all if I've used a lipstick and then they're going to put the lipstick on obviously like they're not bothered so yeah a lot of it does go to friends or to family and then we have some more matte bombs which I'm going to keep these because I need these mainly for like work I need to do pictures and stuff for work so I'll keep these I'm going to get rid of the Harley Quinn lip gloss because I don't think you can get that anymore anyway so there's quite a few stuff that I do keep just in case I need to do any videos any at home content and stuff for work because I mean you probably know this but <laughs> just in case you don't you know because I don't say it enough but I do work for Revolution the reason that I say it so much is just to be like completely transparent about why I have even more rev stuff than I used to have because obviously I used to buy it all anyway um but now I'm kind of I have it because it works so anyways um we have some more colour pop here this is again some of the stuff that um Ruby sent me bless her she's so cute and we have um two like velvet um lipsticky things and they're again like brand new so they don't need to um be like smell or anything and then this one I have had this one for quite a while actually so I've done a little sniff yeah that one's gone off Oof. stinky <laughs> so that one's gone in the bin and then back here we have a lot of the lip glosses lip, lip glosses a lot of the gloss um glosses from Rev so kind of like um shimmer bombs um pout bombs and all that kind of good stuff so shimmer bombs i am like 100 percent keeping because they are unbelievable like so so good so they're, they're definitely getting kept i'm gonna get rid of this one to a new home and this one because these were like from limited edition christmas sets so i'm gonna get rid of them to a new home same for the love island clear one give that to a new home as well and the Batman one, just because again, you can't buy these. So, just want to get rid of them. Some gels can have them. And then we've got, what's this one? I don't actually know what this one is, because it hasn't got like, I'm guessing it was like a limited edition. So, and I haven't used that, so I'll give that to somebody else. And again, we have more pout bombs. I just love revs lip glasses i'm gonna get rid of this monica one laura will definitely be snatching that one out of my hands oh we have the lip shake ones which i absolutely love so again i'm gonna keep them like so and then back here we have again some more limited edition ones so i will give these to a new home as well we have the elf ones um from the i hat revolution collection and we also have one of the brats ones which i actually bought with my own money this one this is before i worked for rev the chloe one actually i might keep this one i really like the color of it she looks this one was like plumping i'll give this to a new home because I'm definitely going to have a colour similar to, like, to that in here. So, yeah. Anyways. Then we have these um, NYX ones, which I'm definitely keeping. The Milky Gloss ones. I bought all of them off somebody on Depop. We have Fenty Gloss. What else do we have in here? And we have some un unopened ones. These are from the I Hat Revolution and Dr. Seuss collection. So, again, I'll give them to a new home and then we have some from the i heart um revolution and sleep and beauty collection as well again i'll give them to a new home as well i think i only tried them in a video so i'll see if somebody else wants them so i did them nyx ones back in because i just couldn't part of them because i don't actually have a black lipstick apart from obviously the matte bombs from rev and they were also a gift from bin so i don't really want to part with them because it's like a little bit of bin in my in my room <laughs> anyways and then moving on to the start from the back over here so these are some w7 um tokyo lip glosses i don't think like this one this one and this one and this one i wouldn't really use them i don't want to use this one and i feel like i've got this one like in other shades so because these are like un i think there's only one that i've 
use, I think. Um, I'm gonna give these to a new home. Oh, oh God, my pile's getting big. I'm doing so well, I'm dead proud of myself. And then we have these three. So we have obviously my Charlotte Tilly one, which I'll be keeping, my P. Louise Holler Gloss, which I'll be keeping, and then my Peaches and Cream Gloss in Cherub that I'll also be keeping. And then next up we have some from Rev Pro. Definitely going to be keeping them. I'm going to see what my mum wants that one. That might be like, that might be a, a Teddy Steve gloss. I like I might have said this in a video before and I've never got around to asking her. I'm going to take a picture now. Yeah, that is very like a mum shade. I'll see if my mum wants it. I've just sent my mum a video showing what it looks like to see if she wants it. <laughs> so I'll see what she says. Um, but yeah, definitely going to keep this other one because like that is absolutely stunning actually let me swatch it these are from like an i'm sure these are from my advent calendar i'm sure they were oh my god yes i'm sorry this camera is like just not focusing at all but like that is absolutely stunning the capital st let's keep that bad boy let me have another xx one i'm sure this is the oh no this isn't xx one sorry the other ones were rev pro yeah, this is the plumping one. I'm definitely keeping that. I really like that. And then we have some ones from Lime Crime. So like a red one and a clear one. Definitely going to keep them too. Ooh, sugar. And then we have a mini Shark Tilbury one. Another mini one. So obviously I'm going to keep that. My oh, mum's just replied saying yes please. So my mum can have that one. <gasps> and then we have these. Which even though I know these are like limited edition. Can't get your hands on them anymore. I'm definitely going to be keeping them. But I'm assuming you can't get your hands on them. They might still be on the website. I don't know. But these are the I Heart Revolution and Cocoa Pebbles collection. These colours of these glosses are just me. Like so so like even this one has like little gold um sparkles in it just like totally me totally me so definitely going to be keeping them and they're very like sentimental because this this was the first ever when i started off working for rev as a content creator i did like two days with them three days of the week being a mental health therapist at my other job um <laughs> this is like the first ever collection that they sent me to do like a video on for like my, my new job with them so not only is it like a collection that I was like oh my god this is in like so good but also my first ever collection that they sent me so yeah absolutely buzzing and uh they mean a lot to me them ones so moving on to who back here so I'm actually gonna give these away to somebody because I haven't opened them and I feel like somebody else will get a lot more use out of these um and love them because they are obviously Nightmare Before Christmas. So um, I'll give these two a good home instead. And then back here we have Pixie ones. You know I absolutely love this gloss. Um, I'm going to keep the clear one because as you can see I've already used it. So I can't give that to somebody else anyway when it's all contaminated. I'm going to get rid of my Roxy one because I won't really use that. And I'm also going to get rid of these two because I won't really use them ones either. So I'll see if somebody else would like them instead oh my pile is getting <laughs> very big keeps rolling off the side and then oh my god this is where it gets really difficult so these are all of the ones that i've collected from i Heart revolution for every single princess collection that they have done um most of these i've bought some of them have been given to me from work but i used to collect these before i even started working for revolution and i just <laughs> I don't know if I'm willing to part ways <laughs> with them just yet. Some of them I definitely can. Like I'll get rid of Snow White because I know I won't. Def I definitely won't use that. Um, I'll get rid of this one because I know I won't really use that one, and this one as well. But then the other ones make it very, very, very difficult to get rid of. I'm about beating the beast. Yeah, I'll get rid of Beauty and the Beast because hers are like straight up gold. I'm going to actually bin that one though because it's got like a stain on the on the actual like uh, applicator. So I'll get rid of that one. Yeah, a lot of them do actually. So I won't I have to get rid of some of them. Yeah, I have to put them in the bin instead just because they're stained. So I don't really feel comfortable giving them away to somebody. Yeah. But my God, it breaks my heart that I'm actually doing this. But I am going to keep Cinderella, Little Mermaid, Aladdin 
and Tangled, which all look very similar, but I'm keeping them ones. I can't, I can't get rid of all of them. Like, I just can't. You're asking a lot of me. There we go. And then what do we have here? I'm going to get rid of this elf one. Oh, actually, no, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep that one. <laughs> then we have this one from um, Ink Credible, which I haven't tried yet, so I'm going to leave that. And then we have the three Powerpuff Girl ones. And a little fun fact, um, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll have seen I went to a festival um, a while back and my friend um, gifted us, me and my other friend, all of us had like matching Powerpuff Girl bracelets. It's like our thing, so I'm a buzz. My friend Laura is um, a book cup and then Jess is Blossom. So what I'll do is I'll actually give them their person. So obviously I'll keep, but I'll give Laura and Jess their ones to match as well. So yeah, they can have a new home with their rightful owners. And then that is literally everything. So I feel like I've done so much better in here. Like I've got rid of so much, it's insane. And a lot of it, thankfully, there's only like a small pile of things that I'll have to get binned. The rest can all be given to a new home, which is really nice, makes me feel better about it <laughs> um, as well. So yeah, I know my mum and my sister absolutely love glosses, so I'll ask them if they want anything as well. But yeah, this is literally me decluttering this drawer, which was so well needed, but it does need like sorting out and organising in a better way, because like this just isn't vibing. And I feel like it's just a shame that it's taken up such a big drawer that I could put other stuff in this drawer instead so I might go back to putting them back into acrylic storage I don't know I haven't decided um I'll work it out in the future <laughs> but yeah this is the drawer decluttered for now and then ignore these boxes these need sorting out but the next drawer is foundations which is just a whole different category <laughs> all different category but yeah thank you so much for watching i really hope that you enjoyed this declutter um definitely done a good job of this one but yeah i'll hopefully see you in another video very soon i'll leave all of my other declutters and like my overall video kind of showing my setup and my makeup collection and stuff link down below so you can go check it out as well but yeah love you so much thank you so much bye